Hey y'all. So it has been a while since I've talked in front of a video again. I keep saying I'm back and then I vanish into the wild abyss and that's not fair to you guys. But anyways, I'm hopefully back again. Today, I am trying to be a girl. I am doing a girly thing that girls do, which is these haul videos and yeah, I thought I'd just do one for the hell of it. Fun fact about me quick that might make me sound like a dweeb or a ignorant asshole, I don't know which, but I like gothic culture, the gothic scene, the gothic things. I would be goth if I could, uh, but re imaging your entire wardrobe is a expensive process and I don't have the money right now because I just started a low paying job. Woo. But I did go onto Kate's clothing website like over a month ago and finally got my stuff and finally I'm sitting in front of a camera. So I thought I would do a Kate's clothing haul thing and of some of the more popular clothing brands that are known for their gothic whatever. I totally don't look gothic in my pink, but whatever, that's fine. So yeah, I'll go ahead and show you what I got. So first on the list, it still even has the tags on it, is I have a, it was like somewhat described as a circle dress and it, <laughs> Let me lean back and show you. That's what it looks like. And the thing I love about it is the high collar right here and it's got clasps on the back. And as I said, this is a necessary evil uh, dress and I freaking love it. I'm so excited to wear it. You wear something of course underneath it, I would hope. But I absolutely love this and yeah, I'm just super excited. This again, also necessary evil, I guess both uh, actual clothing items I got were of necessary evil and this is just like a tunic sort of poncho type outfit it's all kind of flowy and long and baggy and the lighting is not doing good right now sorry about that it's got a, a lace front on it and it's just it looks super comfortable wear and I really really I like things that are loose and kind of flowy a little bit and then this is Devil's Fashion. Okay, so I'm gonna get close enough so you can see this. This is a Devil's Fashion. Ah! Isn't that glorious of a choker? Like I have a, I have a new obsession with chokers and this one was I think on sale and it's, it's just, it's magnificent and it's dangly and it's lace and I freaking love it. So if I ever actually did give in to my gothly urges um, my fashion, I think, would be very much inspired by the fields of Nephil Nephilim? Nephilim? For some reason, I don't think there's another E in there somewhere, but uh, they dress up like cowboys kind of thing, and it sounds completely stupid, but they do it really well. I don't know if I'd call that American Victorian goth or what, because the same time period as Victorian. But when I saw this at Kate's Clothing, this is an Et Knox. Um, necklace and it's a steer head and it's so freaking cool look at that it's just it's awesome it's sort of that mix that I would love to put together with my fashion and my my look that I would go for it was just absolutely perfect addition to that so I can wear this without getting weird looks too so it's even better yeah, that's all I have for my little clothing haul. I got off work and I still looked nice before I went and worked out, so I was like, hey, I'll just shoot this video. Also, isn't my Epica flag awesome as well? Over here is where my actual official YouTube wall will be, but I figured I'd just sit on my bed and do this clothing haul for you guys. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you all next time. Bye! Damn, son, isn't that enough?